What's up, YouTube? Hey, 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 it's your girl Tamika for real, and I'm back again with another video for you guys. Your girl been gone since I did that damn reenactment of your boy chilling with Walt. <laughs> Y'all, I feel so played. I went back and I looked at that damn video and I laughed at myself so many times. But y'all, y'all made me feel good. Y'all was like, y'all was in my inbox talking about girl. You did walk better than with what Walt did itself. Y'all was like, do another reenactment and all this and other stuff. I love that. Thank y'all so much. For all of my new subbies, like just everything. All the uplifting words. Thank y'all. Because y'all don't know how many, you know, let me just say this. Y'all don't know how long I wanted to do a reenactment of him. But it was just like, I thought people was going to judge me. And, and you know, just a lot of stuff. But you guys were the best. And I thank y'all for that. Um, I want to first welcome my new subscribers and my old subscribers back to the channel tell you guys thank you for like comment and please like comment and subscribe to the channel and if y'all want to see me doing any more reenactments comment down below and let your girl know you know because i can do reenactments i'm very crazy i told y'all i don't call myself tamika for real for nothing i always say that and this way i don't want to act right y'all like the old people see this way i don't want to act right but yeah Y'all made your girl feel very, 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 very loved. And y'all had me laughing, you know, at my own self. I, a couple of times when I read y'all comment, I was like, let me go back and see how hilarious I was. And it was so funny. But yeah, your boy Walt is so easy to do. I mean, he talks so slow. And it, his swag is just like, you know, like he just, it is what it is with him. Take it like it comes. He ain't playing with nobody. What he says is what it is. You know, and I just love my boy Walt. It ain't entertainment purposes only. You know, that's my boy. I really, you know, I really do dig Walt. I'm not lying. A lot of people that I do talk about, like, you know, I'm not gonna say talk about, but I do discuss in my content. I have no problem with them. I don't know those people from Adam or Eve. They don't know me. So, I mean, if they wanna come and do a video about me, hey, have at it. You know, it's all in fun and games. But anyway, I want to tell you guys, like I said, like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Um, guys, I am getting a little bit hoarse, I guess. I don't know. Um, I've been talking all damn day. But um, welcome to the channel if you guys are new. Thank you guys for all the lovely comments. And thank you guys for all the uplifting comments. As I said, if you guys want to see your girl do some more reenactments, let me know. Because I'm a whole fool with it. I'm a gangster with it. I'm just playing. But yeah, so... Um, yeah, I want to start doing shout outs to people because y'all been too good. I got so many people that's the same people tell me good morning, like, hey girl, what's up? Or just everything, like, you know, and I love that. But anyway, we got a lot to discuss, y'all. So we about to get in that thing. Turn your post notification bells on, y'all. If you know what the post notification bells are, that's that little post notification button that'll let you know every time I drop a new video. And that way you ain't got to be going on my channel trying to see if I didn't. It's going to tell you. Bing, Tamika did another video. Go see what your girl got, because y'all know I'm entertaining. I mean, I'm saying entertaining and entertainment at the same time. Entertaining. I mean, y'all know what I mean. So anyway, let's get straight to the point. Coming to America. How many of y'all watched that movie? Drop it down below. Y'all, why the hell is people talking about this movie not good? I watched this movie literally when I found out it was on Prime, Amazon Prime. We watched it literally two times back to back. Oh, and I think I'm going to probably bounce back and watch it again tonight. Know why we watched it back to back, y'all? Because I was cooking the first time. And when I'm in the kitchen cooking, he got a habit of starting the movie all behind. But, you know, while I'm in the kitchen, shuffling my pots and stuff, I don't like that. I'm just like, I want to be comfortable. And laying down, and I want to focus. So I missed some parts. So I was like, let's double back. But anyway, I want to say, whoever lied and said that movie wasn't good, they lied. That was so good. I mean, it wasn't part one. You can't never go back and, you know, bring back a part one. But I can say, all of the comedians, all of the actors and actresses, they... Invested in support two, they ain't do none of that in part one. And that stuff was good. Wesley Snipes, oh my God. 
He really did his thing. Tiana Taylor, she was so beautiful. Oh my God. From the little short haircut, everything. Y'all. But I didn't know though. I did not know up until after I had watched the movie like twice that um what's Eddie Murphy uh name on the movie was? Oh, Hakeem. Hakeem, mama was really dead in real life. I didn't know that. You know. I didn't know that. I was wondering why she was not on the movie, but had I, I didn't know. Because, y'all, she played on Roots, too. I want to say she was Kuta Kente's mama. We had to Google it up, and that's when we found out. So, I mean, and she was a very, very talented artist, you know, actress. Yeah. So, y'all, yeah. And then they wanted to talk about the barbershop scene. Talking about the, you know, the critics. You know, the critics always got something to see. Talking about the people from the, the men from the barbershop. Why they still on this episode? Because it's a sequel. 30 years, 30 years later, they feel like why still alive. 30 years later, they want to know why they still alive. <laughs> well, you know, that's true. But damn. People live to see old, old age. Yeah, but I mean, they still look the same. But people are so crazy. That's just like when they made the Tyler Perry uh, movie. Remember? A Fall from Grace. Every, every every little detail. When it's a, dealing with a black film. About slippers here, slippers yeah, she there. came downstairs. She had slippers on when she was upstairs. Oh, she came downstairs. So it's gonna be that time. They gonna you know black. But yeah, when it's one of them damn uh, white. What I'm just saying. You know what it is. Yeah, y'all know what it is. They don't look for detail, but we need to start looking for detail. That's what they do to us, y'all. Yep. I'm just saying. So anywho. I'm just saying, if you never watched it, go watch it. Don't let nobody tell you that movie ain't good. Because why the hell you think? Anytime you put Wesley Snipes, I can't name all the rest hey, of them comedians. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it was just too many of them for that movie not to be good. That's all, I'm gonna, that's all I got to say. So anyway, we're going to move on to the next ones. Because my videos don't be that long. I just want to test bases with y'all. Because y'all know your girl be on it. Anywho. I'm about to dip and dab on some YouTube street business. What the hell Carmen and Corey got going on, y'all? I don't really deal with them because they're younger than me. But I, I do, you know, from time to time, I dip and dab and I watch their channel. And I found out Carmen was pregnant recently. But I did see she was spotting. Let me tell y'all something. Now, I watched that video. And at first, I ain't gonna lie, I was gonna come on here with some misinformation because I really thought she had miscarried till up until I went back and I watched the whole video. Because I like to come with facts, y'all. Because if I be lying, I'm dying. I'm not about to come, with, come on here with no lying ass information. I feel like this. When it comes to that Carmen and Corey situation, now they young, they, they like my, my daughter's age, my oldest daughter's age. So they ain't my business. I don't really dip and dab in children's business. I don't really watch. Nick and King and all them little young kids, I don't do that. I try to stick with my era. But I will say this. Some YouTubers need to get it together. And I will say that to say this. When you come from, when you start from the bottom and now you're here, like the song say, started from the bottom, now we're here. Some of them don't understand what we here mean. Okay? Corey got an arrogant ass attitude. And he act like he, his shit don't stink. And Carmen just looked like she just, you know, she just followed his lead. You know, whatever he says, is what it is. You know. Um, he looked like he got the, the, the fancy, you know, fancy cars and all this other stuff. And all of this and that. So nothing even matter him, to him no more. You can't tell him nothing. You go mess around and you go, um, you, you, you turn around and Carmen would... Corey turn on your ass in the damn New York second. You mess around and go. Let me see what I can say. You eat a lobster in front of Corey. Y'all go to date lunch. You and Corey, him together. You know? I'm his boy. He my boy. He got crawfish. I got lobster. You know? Next day, people want to know what y'all ate. I say, Corey, don't tell nobody I ate lobster because... I've been lying, saying I'm allergic to lobster. Don't let nobody know. Oh, I ain't gonna let nobody know. You know I got this. I ain't gonna let nobody know nothing. I ain't gonna let nobody know nothing. Corey ain't gonna let nobody know nothing. Yeah, we, we both ate crawfish. 
But while you fuck around and make Corey mad, Corey gonna tell the whole world, your ass allergic to lobster, but you ate lobster. That's a messy ass little boy. He done turned on King. He done turned on Damien, uh, Prince, a lot of them. He need to get it together. He got arrogant ass ways. I don't like the way he talk. I watched a video today and I heard him talking about he about to stop doing YouTube because the little kids, he'll whoop their ass because they say too much and this and that, this and that. First of all, your only ass you need to be whipping is your own. And that girl you messing with. That girl telling all your damn business. Because that girl let it out. How the hell that girl knew that Carmen had to burn Aiden? Okay? Then they come out, yeah, it was an accident. Yes, it was an accident. But how the hell she knew? That girl came with text messages, everything. Why the hell your ass ain't never over there? Some of you always got to go check on your daddy. Yo, you always selling cars for your daddy or whatever the hell your ass doing. You be lying. You ain't got to lie, Craig. You ain't got to lie. You do too much with yourself. And Corin, I'm talking about Corin. Trying to say Carmen and Corey, y'all. I got so much to say. Carmen trying to act like she trying to act like she understand English. I don't think she understand English too much. Okay? She ain't here with enough black girls to understand that. Corey ain't what it is. He, he act like his shit don't stink. And that's one little boy that if he gonna stop doing YouTube, get the hell on. Get the stepping, like Martin say. Because your attitude stink. I feel like you felt like you done got on that pedestal to where you feel like you done got enough money to where you think you really like, you don't need YouTube no more, but you never forget where you come from. That's all I'ma say. That is all I'ma say. I'ma leave your ass alone. You gonna feel it one day. Now let's get on to the real deal, Holy Spirit. Damien and Erica, I was about to say Damien and Erica cry. They ain't married. The Cryer family. Damien put that girl, I don't, I, I'm not going to say Damien put that girl through the worst because I don't know, I'm not in there, I'm not a fly on the wall, but both of them, you can tell every, almost every two, three months, I'm not sure if it's clickbait or what the hell they got going on, for views, I guess y'all know they just bought them two brand new ass vehicles, huh? I can't even talk, y'all know they just bought them damn brand new vehicles, huh? y'all know they lied about having twins, huh? so ain't nothing they won't do for the money. I don't, at this point, I don't believe nothing they ass is saying. Anytime you lying about a goddamn baby that you never bitching no more in your damn videos, anything holds. Now all of a sudden, he talking about he about to leave Dallas. He on a video with his daughter Margaret talking about he would never date a, a, a woman from Houston no more. She would have to be from another state. Eric on there talking about nobody ever loved her. He on there talking about he got trust issues. Yo. Erica saying that she go above and beyond for people. She been threatening him. Yes. He talking about he got to move. The reason is because too many people threatening him. Now, who the hell threatening his ass? Yo. Kind of shit. But I want to say this, though. Y'all been checking out Love by Erica, um, little videos? Erica been fashion over it the hell out. Them been some cute little top shit been wearing. Makeup. Man, music all in my video. Don't even give a damn if she could demonetize. I wonder if she gave you Lance that day. <laughs> Lance said, I want you. Okay. We been, excuse me, y'all. We been friends for years, but I want you. And Damien even mentioned, I don't want nobody throwing in my face what a, another band could do for you. Well, Erica, let me tell you something, girl. Woman to woman. Obviously, that man saw what Damien wasn't doing for you. And that man said, I'm tired of looking at you stressing. That was deep. That man said, I want to do for you what he ain't doing for you. What in the hell more you want? You know, that man all about himself. If you can't see that, anybody can see Damien cries all about himself. All about the Prince family. All about, you know, he talk about his kids and this and that. Girl, do you and continue to do you because you do a good job. You know, I may have did videos on you talking about you delete a video because you did. And you shouldn't have deleted that damn video. Keep your stuff up. Keep yourself up. You've been looking very beautiful. And let him wonder. You know, men like that, he's much older than you. You know, you don't owe him nothing. You're a young girl. So what you had a baby from? You ain't the first and you ain't going to be the damn last. You know? Keep it going, girl, and keep it coming. Do your videos every day, and don't let, don't give up. That's all I gotta say. And I love your faith in God. I will say that.
Keep it coming, okay? Damien need to get it together. That's all I got to say. So, I'm about to end my video, y'all. Y'all came my little tea. Y'all know I do. But anyway, your girl about to end this video. Like I said, y'all want to see your girl do another reenactment? Let me know who y'all want it to be. <laughs> Don't choose nobody all hard and stuff. Chilling with Wall was very easy. That's my dude. Anybody y'all choose going to be my people. But y'all let your girl know. Y'all thumbs this video. I can't even talk. Thumbs this video up. Y'all, I'm like, wow, I done had me a drink. I ain't had no damn, what wall drink? Crown? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't had none of that. But your girl feeling good. Thumbs this video up. Give me some um love. Turn the post notifications on. And that's what it is. I love you guys. Continue to stick with the girl. Subscribe to the channel. Y'all trying to get a thousand. Y'all, so I can go live. Then I can really reenact these people. All right, y'all? Love you guys. Peace.